I'm joined here today for Primetime Local News with Rochelle Cube with Yoga Stay Studio. Thank you so much for joining us today. Now, can we start off with explaining what these powwow classes are that'll be offered soon? Yeah, definitely. So we are going to have powwow fitness and it's a one hour class. So in this class, they're going to lead you through some footwork. They're going to teach you about the different uh, dance styles. So there'll be some grass dance, jingle dress and just all sorts of footwork. So basically it's going to give you a little taste of what some of the dancers endure over a weekend of powwow. So lots of cardio and lots of footwork. And there will be five classes offered? There is. So every Wednesday we're doing a series of five. Um, if you wanted to sign up for all five, it's $65. Um, you can do this through um, EMT, which is uh, e-transfer, or you can sign up through our website, uh, which is yogastay.ca. Now, will it be you or someone else hosting each of these classes? That's a great question. Me, myself, am not teaching the powwow fitness. There is a beautiful lady named Christina Knight. Uh, I was introduced to her through a mutual friend. She is a powwow god, I will say, and she's going to teach us all of the tricks and techniques that we need to know in order to just learn a little bit of powwow. You um, don't necessarily need to sign up for a powwow once you're done, but at least you kind of have a little bit of an idea as to why they're doing repetitive footwork or even to why they do some of the moves. How has reaction been online after releasing the dates of when the classes are? Oh my goodness. On Monday, I just put it out there. And honestly, right now I only have three spots left. So out of the 12, I only have three. So if you are interested, make sure you get those payments in. Um, like I said, you can sign up for all five. If I can't fill the classes to 12, then we'll do a drop in at that point. But I think we're gonna be able to sell out. <laughs> Now, what all can residents expect to be doing during each of these classes? Well, like I said before, you're going to go through some of the footwork. Um, we'll start with a little bit of stretching and then we're going to get into the different types of footwork and the different types of dances that are out there as well, because not one sort of dance is the same. Why does Yoga Stay Studio believe it's important to offer these for residents in the community? Oh, this is good. I am First Nations myself, so I take a lot of pride in being um, First Nations and having a yoga studio. When we first started, we were just a kids and family yoga studio. In April of this year, I have grown a little bit and I was gifted a couple of adult yoga teachers. So now I just love having workshops and not only doing yoga, being able to bring in all sorts of types of fitness into the studio, as well as workshops. I love hosting workshops. So if anyone out there is able to want to put on a workshop or have a special talent or maybe something that they would like to share with the community, Yoga Stay is the place to come and have it. Um, I have tables, I have chairs, I have the perfect space for you to gather and to be able to share with the community what you have to share. And you were saying earlier that classes were getting filled up already. Where and how can people register in case they aren't aware? Could you expand a bit more on that? Definitely. So if you wanted to register, you can go to my Facebook page, which is Yoga Stay um, Studios, and then all the information is on there you'll be able to send me an e-transfer, which again is on the Facebook page, or you'll be able to sign up through our app. In case those last three spots fill up quick, are there future classes planned after these five? Definitely. Now, if the three spots fill up super quick, um, there is an option to add another class so we can open it up to another 12 people. So technically we could have 15 people available, but maybe we'll just offer another five classes after this um, session is a go because it's so popular. And is there anything else you'd like to add for people to know about that Yoga Stay Studio has planned for the rest of the summer or the starting next fall? Um, well, starting in September, we're going to be having a new fall schedule. So we're going to be adding in some more adult classes as well as some kids classes. So just a schedule shake up basically in September. Perfect. Well, once again, thanks so much for joining us today, Rochelle. Thank you. Thank you for having me.